What is up, beach bums? Man, let me just start out by saying it's been a tough week. I've fished a lot this week, and the surf is terrible right now. This has been the hardest week for surf fishing that I've experienced in a long time. But it is January, so it's to be expected. But it's still frustrating. I've had a very frustrating week. Fished a lot of hours, haven't caught a lot of fish, haven't been able to make videos. It's been tough. But fortunately, I have a saving grace. Drew hit me up. They've been catching some sheepshead here. This is his son, Trip, And they've been doing pretty good at this spot. Uh, a lot of people know about it, so it's not really much of a secret, but uh, to fish it from land, you are supposed to have permission, which we do. So we're looking for some sheepshead. He's caught some big ones out here. We're gonna drop some fiddler crabs down. We've been chumping them up. Hopefully we can get on some action here real soon. All right, sheepy, sheepy. Where you at? Can y'all make a good sheep no noise? Y'all, uh, let me hear it. Let me hear it. Huh? Let me hear a bah. Let me hear a bah. Bah. <laughs> <laughs> That's not very convincing. I I'm not convinced. I'm not. <laughs> the boy on the boat the other day, he could i know i know no that that was dusty have you ever met have you ever met dusty i was cracking up because like all day he kept doing it and he'd do it and i was like dude it sounds like we had a dang goat on this boat <laughs> try to get a hold of it <clears throat> chris did you have one yeah they got they got gotcha, you man hurry up get back on they got gotcha. you i think your bait's gone bro i'm not gonna get on you go ahead you know, get on you yeah, he got you. When you're not catching fish and you're just observing people, and, and if you're in an area where there's a lot of people fishing, it's interesting to see kind of how things take place. And yesterday, the most fish were caught, you know, because I was watching the boats and that were there fishing at the pass, and of course the people on the, on the wall. The most fish were caught in the period of time that the tide was changing, which is slack tide. That, that's when they actually started turning on. And then, you know, outside of that, there was, you know, one peppered here and there, but the the quickest bite was in that period, which I would not have thought that. Yeah. But uh, I guess maybe just the changing of it is what kind of got them going. Bring them over. <clears throat> Try to keep them around the pot. Oh, sorry, Here, let me get out your way. <laughs> My bad, <laughs> didn't know you were coming this way. <laughs> Trip strikes first blood. First blood, get him trip. Don't let him whip you, man. Can you uh -oh. Can you let me get out your way. You Quit being a cheerleader. Ah, oh, yeah, that's. Why would you say that? Just to keep him off the pile. Yeah, you said, can you get him around the pile? And... Explain to me your feelings. Oh. Your feelings right now, trip. <laughs> Communicate that to me. It sucks. <laughs> Probably will never trust my daddy. Again. <laughs> oh. Hey, that was a good sheep, man. That was a solid, solid fish. <laughs> as far as landing the fish, this is definitely not the most conducive area. Dang. There, there we go. Here we go. Let's get this one. He's not as big. Not big. You can probably flip him. <laughs> That's a little baby sheep. Well, that's the first technical catch of the day. He's legal if you wanted him. That's all right. We can, we can toss him back. Oh, dude, that was a sheep head. Oh, yeah? yeah did did you splash the top of the water? Really? That's wild. Oh, he's right there. Where? Oh, that's wild, man. Right there on that, uh, like I said, I've yet to see it down here yet. But then, yeah, he's, he's swimming right here on this pylon. Oh, something's. With a sheep head on the pylon. Oh. Oh, dang. There was one. They're all over. Did you see that? Yeah. They're all over. One, one just had one. It, right there. You see them? One, one had it in his mouth. They're, uh, they're, I just saw a bunch of them pulling right there. You see them right there? Right there. Where, where are they at? Where are they at? Right in the middle. I don't have glasses on, I can't see. Man, that was wild. I mean, it was a ton of them. Yeah, I, I saw them too. One, one of them had my crab in its mouth, and I saw I, wa I was watching my weight <laughs> move around. 
and it won't stay on the fuel long. Yeah, I just checked radar. It's, you know, it's, it's just little bu like little bubbles of rain. It's not anything serious yet, but it's, it's probably about to start getting worse soon a little bit. Dang it! Dang, I didn't set the hook. I didn't think it was a fish. Dang, Dang it! Uh, Dang it! Well, this this is the spot right oh, here. Yeah. This is where we this is where we've hooked all three of them. Dad gum, that was a good fish. <laughs> Dad gum, I'm a terrible fisherman. I didn't have the camera rolling. You guys caught the last second of that. I didn't think it was a fish. I, I couldn't even tell. I was just lifting up to move. I never even felt them. Oh, Dang. Got him, got him, got him. Oh, come here, buddy. <laughs> oh, that's a good That's a good. All right, where I got to go? To my left? Come here, dude. All right, this is the tricky part right here. Yeah, land in, the, land in these jokers. Let's see, where are we looking? Oh, please stay on. Please stay on. All right, there we go. The camera was yep. All right. <laughs> Woo! The spell is broken. <laughs> Victory. Get him over there on that side. Yeah. Gone. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. You are my hero, man. You are my hero. He it. Did he? Well, good. I don't care. We're killing him anyway. He's awesome. Hey, high fives all around right here. I'm pumped, man. Guys. You don't even know how pumped I am about this fish right here. The amount of hours that I've put in this entire week trying to catch a legit fish, you don't even want to know. It's embarrassing. But it's January and it's been extremely tough. I even sheep's head fished for myself under the bridge yesterday for about eight hours. Got like two bites, didn't catch a fish. So I've been feeling I've been feeling it this week. It's been it's been tough. So this is a very I'm proud of this fish. I'm super proud. Pumped about it. Thankful for Drew and Trip <laughs> for bringing me out here so that I can catch a fish. So he's going to eat good and it's going to be probably one of the best tasting fish I've ever had. Well, it's been quite the week. I've spent a lot of time surf fishing, which is pretty useless this past week or was pretty useless this past week. There was Really no point in being on the beach. There's really just nothing happening. I put in about a solid 16 hours over three days of actual fishing time, not traveling, setting up like actual six, 16 hours with baits in the water at seven different locations and only managed four bites, three of which were stingrays and one got away from us. So I did decide to shift gears. I, I went sheep's head fishing yesterday and spent about eight hours at Perdido Pass Bridge and got, I think, two bites and uh, no fish. There hasn't been much to write home about this week. It's It's been tough, and that happens. That's fishing. You know, that's part of it, especially in January for surf fishing. Like, that's pretty historical. I've actually posted a couple of videos where I had not caught any fish and that was last January that I did that if you happen to remember maybe I'll post links maybe I won't I don't know they're not very good videos <laughs> and today's video uh, at least we caught fish I know there's not a ton of action but uh, I figured I had planned to post this video today really regardless of what happened just to come in and tell you guys that it's been a tough one so it will turn around things will change we will start catching fish again I promise uh, just just tough right now that's and that's part of it. But thanks to Drew and his son Trip for hooking me up and getting me on a fish and actually seeing some fish caught. That was fantastic. Thanks to you. I uh, otherwise probably would not have a video right now. So very useful. And I hope you enjoyed it. I, I've enjoyed sheep's head fishing, even though I haven't really caught a lot of sheep's head. Still learning um, how that works and trying to figure it out. And it, 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 there's an added difficulty, of course, doing it primarily from land you're obviously limited on locations a lot of time and moving and all that but it's been fun i've really enjoyed it and when i do catch catch sheep's head it's, it's definitely exciting it definitely gives you a good rush and they pull hard and, and they do taste delicious 
But guys, I really appreciate you hanging with me on this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I had fun today. It was a good time hanging out uh, with Drew and Trip, and catching that at least one sheep's head that I can bring home and cook and eat. It'll be delicious. Hopefully the surf will turn around soon enough and we'll be catching Tasty Pompano coming here soon. We got the spring rolling right around the corner. Can't wait. It's going to be a lot of fun. But guys, as always, you stay bummy.